friends, I am Dr. Prashant Sharma and we are watching Medico's Hub. In this lecture, I am going to discuss the structures passing through the foramen magnum. Foramen magnum is the largest foramen of the skull. Now, if we see, uh, this is somewhat oval in shape with the uh, narrow anterior end, the broad posterior end. The structures passing through, the narrow anterior end are this is apical ligament of dance or odontoid process. This is vertical band of cruciate ligament. And this one is membrana tanktoria. Membrana tanktoria is a strong flat band, fibrous band, which covers the dense and most of its uh, most of its ligaments. So these are the structures passing through the anterior narrow part of foramen magnum. Now the structures passing through the broad posterior part are this one is the lowest part of medulla oblongata and these are the three meninges. This one is dura mater, this one is arachnoid and this one is pia mater. So three meninges and the lowest part of medulla oblongata. These two structures pass through the posterior wide or broad part. Now there is another area that is subarachnoid space. This is arachnoid, red one, and this space is subarachnoid space. Like this space is subdural space. This is subarachnoid space. So the structures passing through subarachnoid space are this is anterior spinal artery. These are vertebral arteries and these are surrounded by sympathetic plexus around them. These are spinal accessory nerves and these are posterior spinal arteries. So these structures pass through the, so these are the structures passing through the broad, sorry, through the subarachnoid space. We can learn this by Ovum of mom said that is odontoid process or dense, the apical ligament of odontoid process or dense, then vertical band of cruciate ligament, then membrana tanktoria. So these are the structures passing through the narrow apical, narrow anterior part. Then lowest part of medulla oblongata and all the meninges. These are the structures passing through the broad posterior part and spinal accessory nerves, anterior and posterior spinal arteries and 
the vertebral artery and sympathetic plexus around it. So these are the structures passing through the subarachnoid space. So hit the like button, share and subscribe our channel to get the latest updates and notifications.